What's up, Internet? It's your boy, XFSX. I'm the creative director for XFSX Studios, where we create 3D animations for music artists and snack brands. So if you have a song or a product that you want to drop and you don't want it to flop, holla at your boy. All my info is in the link in the description. Blah, 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 blah. Let's jump into the video for today. Today we have uh, Ritz. We have Ritz Carlton with MTL State of Mind. <laughs> Alright, I can't you all know my eyes are fucked up and I can't read. It's Riz with and Nick. Riz Nick. Alright. Y'all are gonna get me in the comments for butchering it. But let's go, man. I'm excited for this video, bro. I seen this on extended MTL and I was like, oh I gotta react to this. Your eyes to what you can't imagine. We all the Zanny Nash and candy smashing, Brady Essen. Like Earl said, you snatched your daddy's jack for bad in practice. I'll call you. I was about to say that was hella Earl. I was about to be like, bro, why you biting Earl's flow? But it's clearly a homage, the same way he's paying homage to uh, Jim. Who's that? Who's that nigga, bro? The nigga, the, the, the nigga who does all the Muppets shit. Jim Henson, Jim Henson. This is, it's a homage to Jim Henson, but I like that. I like I like me a nigga that can dress up in a fur suit. Pause. <laughs> Frank Sinatra, cause I see just how you act. What? You love me and I hate you. Yeah. I love you and you love me. Yeah. Yeah. You hate me and I love you. Yeah. You love him and then we do this shit all. I was gonna ask, are those real freckles or is he on that TikTok wave where he's tattooing freckles on his face? I guess we'll never know. Get away with sin. Yet you pray to God to bless you with a man. I'm focused on the end. I know the world don't end. The world projects itself on how you treat it. So if you negative, that's exactly what you gon' feed it. You blaming God for your mistakes, but that's not a valid reason. Committed treason. That's true. Can't blame God for your mistakes, man. It's like these only fan girls, bro. They be blaming God for everything, dude. Oh no, the devil made me do it. Yeah, that's exactly what they should be saying, bro. The devil made him do it, not God. You claim that you are demon time, especially in the winter time. Waiting in those club lines, snowing up those white lines. <laughs> yeah, that's so Montreal state of mind. I don't know how I feel about the Olympic Stadium, bro. I know he's just using it once again to pay homage, but bro, I fucking can't stand Olympic Stadium for Montreal, bro. I'm sure we have more iconic places than that, guys. But yeah, I like this, bro. The the the, the youngin has like this flow that's like it's a mix of a couple different things. Like there's that Earl part a little from the start. It kind of reminds me of Gambino. It reminds me of a uh, uh, a voice's name Chance. Also, it has that Chance that sort of steel to it. But it also has like this, like almost like a little bit of like the internet and Steve Lacey. I'm hearing as well, which is interesting. And like this, is this, this just you can tell this is just like a, a melange, bro. Like this kid just has so many influences and he wears them all on his sleeve, which sometimes can be a bad thing. But the way he's mending it all together, blending it all together, it creates a really new smoothie. You know, it's like you can have blueberries and bananas on their own. But once you mix blueberries and bananas together, you know, you have a blueberry banana smoothie, man. And that in itself is a whole new taste profile. That's so Montreal, state of mind, baby. I catch you on Saint Laurent too much, baby. See you on that boulevard. Dancing and shit going up and down. You fucking My question is like, where does one find this mask? Like, where do you get this outfit? You love him and then we do this shit Like, where do you get this outfit from, dude? This 
It also is giving me like hella like men I trust vibes as well. And men I trust is swag. Oh, I didn't realize. I thought it was freckles, but it's not freckles. It's just a hell of a lot of makeup to make him seem more ugly than he is. I'm not saying the young is. I'm not. God damn it. He clearly is wearing some shit that is supposed to amplify this sense of like monster that he's supposed to be, you know, or at least the, the monster that everybody thinks they are. And so that's what we kind of reflect on the outside. Like we kind of think poorly about ourselves and then it creates this image on the outside that people see that isn't too pleasant. I think that's what the youngin is trying to touch on. So this is Nick, Nike, Nick. He's gonna come in for like what the last four bars. That's quite a vanguard, I must say. In this bitch night, rolling on that boulevard. Maybe this ain't what you start. This that old school, that old school. You know that. That <sighs> Noah's Ark. <laughs> I got bars too. I got bars. I got bars. All right, guys, appreciate you watching to the end of the video. If you watched, awesome. If you didn't, well, that's okay. Slowly I die more and more inside. See you guys later.